Black Lotus. Darn. K Winnette, thanks for the 65 months. Bye -bye. Uh, bye -bye. Mm -hmm. No long stream today. Emily's pulling me out. What? I'll blame it on mom. Pulling me out. I gotta leave early today. It's not early, it's like you're normal. I leave super early. She gets to leave at like three something today, super, which is his normal time. Super, kids. super early. Like for 20 minutes because you know. we have to go look for a house God, can, i can stream for 20 minutes today and then i'm gonna go we need to get some room for the kids and he's like mm, love you mm -hmm. i have a good day okay love you too mm -hmm. bye guys freya's uh, right? nice <laughs> freya's in a mood uh oh what am i taking here Tropical. I'd rather have the colors of steam vents, but I'll take tropical. Okay, we just take the windswept heath now. You know what? Let's go land heavy. Let's take lands to start things off. Master Alucard, thanks for the twenty-two months. Oh. All right. What do we got here? Savannah now. I'm gonna keep taking lands. It's still fine, but it's not busted like it is in Legacy. No fetchable lands here. Uh, all right, well we gotta do something different then. Just devoted druid. Got a lot of green lands right now. A lot of green land. Hmm. All right, I'll take Druid. Terastodon. I don't. I don't know if I want to do green things in Vintage Cube though. The only green thing I want to do in Vintage Cube is like Leobold or Channel. I'm just gonna take the Blooming Marsh here. I have not updated Storm in the slightest. Uh, don't know decks for Monday and Tuesday. I do, however, need to practice standard for the MCQ thingy that's happening, what, Saturday? I believe it's Saturday, right? I guess they sent me an email about it. Check that. This has to be a good card. Join the MCQW. During the weekend of May 25th, the event you will join on Saturday, May 25th, between 6 a.m. and 7 a.m. will be visible after the update, the 23rd. Starting 6 at the... Players will have until 7 a.m. to complete the step, blah, blah, blah. Once you have started the event, you will be given the option to submit your deck. Short stream? No. It'll be a normal stream. Finish up around 2.30ish. Ah! Almost didn't get a card there. What does Wilderness Reclamation do in this cube? Could just ditch everything I've already taken and just go back to stacksing people like we did yesterday. Or storming. All right, I'm gonna take Braska here. I actually think just Sultai stuff is a good deck. Link it. Just link it up. Hmm. Hmm. Another wonderful morning. All right, we gotta try the Vivian out now. Ooh, well, no. Seed seems like it hurts us more than it helps us. Would I play Jeskai again? I would change it up in some way. Misty and Polluted Delta. I guess I'd rather take Polluted as it finds all three colors then. Whereas Misty doesn't currently find a black source. Also take Teferi. Hmm. 
I think my guy, I might just go with the creeping tar pit. More fixing. To a courser. Pretty good with all the fetches we already have. Take a ram and nap. Mold drifter. It'll push. I'll take ram and nap. We'll see if we get strip mine or something silly. I think I'm in a draft deck. Jeez. I guess Smokestacks and Ramanap also does stuff. Pretty lackluster, though. I don't really want to be running creature decks in Le or Vintage Cube. Not that you can't have good creature decks. It's just... They don't feel as broken. I kind of want to take Sundering Titan over God. Titan would hurt us a lot, too. Actually, I'm just going to take Elf. F it. Do the stupid creature deck. Nebraska, though. Over Sylvan Karyotid. Go Whisper. Meh. <coughs> ah, man. Excuse me. Uh, I have not been invited to play in fandom this week. So my guess would be no. Crucible now too? How can we how can we abuse this? How can we abuse that at all? Beyond the smokestack. I'm gonna take it still. This is good redundancy. And if we do find something broken to do with it, then it's gonna be that much better. Rex Sage or Free Booty. Uh, yeah, Rex Sage is good. Shallow Grave. I already passed the Emra Cool. Yeah, it gives your creatures plus one plus one or whatever. Modern Horizons, Horizons man. Looking, looking like a snack. Jeskai Feather, Thousand Year Storm deck. Sounds bad. <laughs> Sorry to say. <sighs> this is like a drop and redraft, unless pack three really gives me the nuts. I think even more than like Black Lotus or Mox or anything like that, I'd rather have a like draw seven effect. Probably still have to take Mana Vault here. Vivian, Sanctum, Pulse, Strix, Primal Command. I mean, a lot of good playables here for us, but... What are my thoughts on Slivers? I only saw that one Sliver. The first Sliver or whatever. Crater. Ooh, Time Spiral. We did it. All right. Great. The real problem with this is that my deck doesn't really abuse the Time Spiral as much as I would like. A perfectly good noble hierarchy here too. But maybe I find out Leovold and it's all worth it. Dude, I always want draw sevens, no matter what the deck is. Because they're just busted. There's the strip mine. <laughs> I have to take it. I have the Crucible and Ramanath, but I'm losing out on Overgrown Tomb, Simic Signet, and a Sylvan Library. Bleh. Let's take the mind and move on. Oracle now. Oh! Oracle, Crucible, Strip Mine! Oh, wait, no, we already had a Courser. But Courser doesn't play an extra land. It's Fast Spawn that I wanted, I guess. Still, that's good. What did we just do? We got it. We have the fast spawn crucible strip mine. Plus coarser, so technically I don't need to lose any life. Urban catacombs, delicious. I need like op. Crasis and Shellbach Isle. Hmm. Also Assassin's Trophy. 
I think I'm gonna try the Krasis here. Well, no, Sheldock's too busted. I have a lot of ways to thin out my deck. No mind. Snake, Green Sun, Lily. This is actually a pretty good Green Sun. Oracle, Rexage, Corsair, or Ramanap. Pretty good utility ones to hit. I need removal here. Do I have to take Maelstrom Pulse? I think I probably should. Arak on the wheel was pretty good as well. I could actually splash Ravages. I have Savannah and I have, what, two fetches that grab it? That might be worth. That might certainly be worth. Uh, I guess Dark Petition might be worse. Although it does find our pieces that we want, but it's a 5-mana tutor, which seems a little bit... Fetch, fetch, strip, belly, fetch. Get all of these, actually. Nice, okay. Yes. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven green sources there. One, three, four, five black sources. One, two, four, five, six, seven blue sources. I don't think I need a basic planes. Four, five, six. I don't know if this is good or not, but it has some uh, fun things it can do. Oh yeah, we do have infinite mana, don't we? Land, strip mine, crucible courser. Yeah, infinite mana. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and just fetch the green source right now. Oh, you didn't play anything? Well, that would be unfortunate if I, you know, had a strip mine. <laughs> I am losing one life, though. This is oh so worth. I had fun there. I don't know about you. <gasps> Ew. <laughs> Is a lot of tasty looking artifacts. <gasps> show and tell? What the heck? Why would you assume a show and tell? No, I'd rather kill their uh, mana first than their creature. I can take hits of damage, but leaving your opponent with excess mana is often a recipe for disaster. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Mm. Mm. Well, blue-green porcelain legionnaire is not something you see too often either. Maybe they have like, um, not Leopold, whatever that other trust person is. Edric, maybe they're like green-blue aggro tempo or something. I don't know. I have a feeling there's some kind of snake or other counter in my future. I think we'd rather get the Rex Sage countered.
Okay. I'll take it. I got in front. Alright, keep thinning out our deck for Shell Dock Isle purposes. Looks like they're doing pretty fair things over there. That makes sense. Pirate Vraska is hiding underneath a cove. Little turtle shell. Uh, in the water. Tezzeret? What the heck? Ooh, that... Uh... Gets Oracle or Corsair. I guess I'd rather have Corsair. Sorry, Oracle. I'm going to play the land first, though, so that Devoted Druid can chump the Porcelain Legionnaire. I want to get the Oracle so that I can play multiple lands every turn. The hierarchy, same thing. Hello, hello. Only have one card left in their hand. Feeling pretty confident here. Nice. Nice. Probably still just safest to kill the. Uh... Oh, wait a minute. And... Never mind, I can do something better. I guess I'm still going to pulse the Tezzeret here, but I'm also going to uh, play out Vraska. Should I get the opportunity to? Because popping fetch and then using this Vraska drawing a card puts me to 20 cards. So then I can Shelly. Pulse the Tez, lead things off. Forest, Nebraska, dude. Hey, easy bingo, bingo, bongo. You know what's pretty awesome? What I can do here is I can Vraska sack the Sheldock Isle and then. Play it from my graveyard with the Crucible again. <laughs> uh, nice little reset. Like I can just continuously shell Dock Isle every other turn. All while still playing multiple lands a turn. People were doing inside trading. People were buying out Sliver Queen before the first Sliver was announced. Gotta keep it. That hand. Has potential. Please don't mana tithe me. Come on, Ram and Apple Crucible. Bam! Oh. Oh my. Oh, actually, we have multiple, multiple good draws that will get back to our strip line. We have Crucible, we have Ramanap, and then we have Green Sun for Ramanap. Charanko. <laughs> oh! I 
I mean, if they want to wasteland my shell dock, then so be it, right? Like, they're so far behind on permanence that I don't think that makes sense for them to do. And I'm not even close to activating shell dock anyways. Hell yeah. Okay. I don't want to sack fast spawn just yet. Oh, oh mistakes were made! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh, anyway, Thalia stopped it anyways. Okay, never mind. I don't feel as bad. Whatever. Thanks for the four months. Yeah, never mind. I don't feel as bad. The reason I ran out the Rex Sage here was just to sacrifice. I'll sacrifice the fast bond now. JC final. Thanks for the three months. So now a wasteland. My uh, shell dock, because they're gonna have to sacrifice it anyways. So this game is actually a lot closer since they probably sandbagged some stuff. Didn't read your note. Where's your note? Ah, oh, damn, that would have hit. Uh, that would have hit uh, Ravenap, and I kept it. Oh yes, oh yes. I guess I could have attacked with Mystic first. Uh, do we need Corsair? Oh, they just scooped. No. I was gonna say I could go shuffle it and find like noble hierarch or something. All right, I think master is probably a better card to have than ravages. Which means I don't need to run Savannah anymore, I believe. Especially since the opponents went running wasteland, might as well just have it as a basic forest. Fatal push also seems like it could be fine. Say like the duress. Yeah, the very common theme with my decks the last few days. Destroy all of my opponent's lands slash permanents. And here we are again. <sighs> oh no! Them being on the play sucks. Is this a ballista? Oh, no, this is porcelain. Darn it. Humbug. Well, if Master survives, we get to start picking off all of their creatures. Nice, okay. I'm actually going to take off their second white source here. A Shade of Duck. 48 months. Alright, so I'm going to jump, block, and then shoot the flicker. Some funny business going on here. I think this really matters, but cute for them. 
That was a hell of a draw. Can't outstacks the stacks player. That doesn't do anything. I get to flash back though. Okay, I guess it does a little bit. No, we will pay. Civil. Quick mine. Again, I don't really care about their uh, port or factory right now. I think taking away their white sources is ideal. Slow squeeze. Slow squeeze. <laughs> Dude, this sideboard, sideboard master of the wild hunt. Holy moly, MVP. Tighter, tighter. <laughs> One land, fast bond. It's this. This would be an amazing fast bond hand. Not because we could ravage early, but we could just courser on turn one. At the end. Nope. Ooh, red deck wins. Okay. I mean, darn. There was a chance that I just go off there and get like ten lands off the top. Hopefully, they don't have a four damage burn spell like Flame Slash. No! <sighs> there were not many spells they could have there individually. They could have had multiple spells, but. Wow, do they not have another burn spell? That would be kind of great. Oh my god. I think I'm actually going to Ravage then. Oh no 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 no! I should have Ravaged before, now I gave them a- ah! With the trigger on the stack. Once I saw that Thief hit, with the trigger on the stack I should have 100%. Oh wait no, that wouldn't have worked. Never mind. I guess, I guess this just wouldn't have worked, but the fact that they didn't kill it on my turn and then main phase attack is a decent sign that, you know, they didn't have a burn there. I don't know, maybe it was awkward. Oh, they're just passing? All right, to hell with it, I'm doing it. I'm not straight up mono red, so I'm doing it. I 
think we want to wait to do that on three. Nah, I think getting Druid, it would just die. I want to get Ramanap. That's fine. I don't think this Mystic is going to survive for a very long time. But we'll find out. Maybe it did. I guess they just have counter. Time walk! Am I dead? Might be dead. <gasps> Time warp. <laughs> got, got bamboozled at first. Until we hit with a thief, I thought they were mono red. Could bring in the fatal push. I think I'm just gonna run it back. Yeah. They're for blue light. Not quite good enough. No green sources. This is probably good enough to keep. Thanks, man. And that again. Let me help you fill your yard. On fire. Ace. They do have a blue source there. Keep them off of Jace for a turn. I'm not doing anything on my turn anyways. What got me on the vintage cube kick? What are you talking about? I'm always on a vintage cube kick. Sand needs to draw like time spiral or something. Green source time spiral. Smokestack is definitely a funny answer to that. Well, there's the green source. Now we need to find a time spiral. Off again. Okay. I mean, this is giving them a lot of cards as well, but... Yes. That wasn't very exciting. The assumption is that we're probably pretty dead. I needed to find, like, the fast bond and the courser and whatnot. Is bonfire for two? I think this is a bonfire for two. Some kind of X spell, anyways. Not sure if there's a way we can come back from this. I guess maybe redrawing Maelstrom Pulse and hoping they don't have any more burn. Do -do -do -do. Do, 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 do. Well, now I'm forced to untap this, so I guess. Rest in pepperonis, my friends. It was a good run. G 
GG's. Yeah, that game one flame slash wrecked me. This channel is sponsored by Inked Gaming. Go to inkedgaming.com for awesome playmats, dice bags, and more.